was telling you, every priest of God, if indeed you are separated as the priest of God, you have got special grace on you to fellowship with the Spirit of God and study the Word of God and come up with the materials that can build people. Timely and seasonal materials. If you ever go to church and every Sunday the message goes to the left, every Sunday the message goes to the left, something is wrong. Something is missing. Because the grace upon the men of God is to be able to design the kind of materials that can build your life. To know where the church is and what kind of messages can take the people from where they are to another level. Amen. Are you getting what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The word of God profits a man. And the profit that we get from the word of God, the Bible says, it is our people of the world are able to see. Mm -hmm. Which means it does not remain in the damnation of the spirit. Mm -hmm. It is translated into the physical, into the nature. Mm -hmm. When you are seated in the presence of God, where God is there, there are things that you carry that you can show to the world. Mm -hmm. The word that you hear here can change your thinking. Can impart special gifts in you mm -hmm. and enable you to function in a different way. Mm -hmm. That's what the word of God is. Are you getting what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, but there are moments where the Spirit of the Lord can come in just to tell you what to speak. Like last Sunday, the materials that we are sharing here, we had direct revelations from God. I took my time to show you about restoration. Not emphasizing on the recovery part. Because you want to know, even if we teach about recovery, it won't be necessary if you don't know you've lost something. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to take my time to show you how we as believers, we lose things. Before we look at recovery, but how do we lose things? We looked at negligence and carelessness. Mm. spiritual ignorance I told you if we were out here in South Bay these could have been serious on their own just to teach on spiritual ignorance mm -hmm. because many people come into places like this and they have no clue mm -hmm. what is awaiting for them mm -hmm. they walk right into the presence of God God is, has actually apportioned their, their miracle and breakthrough but they can't be aware. It's just a job. Mm -hmm. who, who slept at the door of heaven, the gate of heaven, and didn't know. Mm -hmm. It's in the morning after the, after the dream that he realized that this place is special. Mm -hmm. It's Bethel. Mm -hmm. It's the house of God. And many have missed a lot of things. Have lost a lot of things. We go out, we think intercession is going to help us. Fasting is going to help us. But there are certain things that are a blade to the children. Mm -hmm. Don't forget about it. It's what God as a father feeds his children. Mm -hmm. Not everything else has to come to you in a form of a blessing. Mm -hmm. In a form of a miracle story. Mm -hmm. There are certain things you receive them as a child yeah. to a father. And it's the blade of life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you see, the bread of life is, in, is, is found in the presence of God. Yeah. Amen. When you come into the presence of God, there is something that God is releasing. Mm -hmm. There are things that happen. I've seen great, great miracles without praying for the people. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Powerful things without praying for the people. Just people walking into the presence of God and they stand up and they say, this is what has happened. Mm -hmm. This is what has happened. Amazing things. We were just watching one of the testimonies that happened recently, I think it's still on the YouTube or at Facebook. A woman that had a problem uh, with his biological uh, 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 systems and processes. She actually stopped. Uh, she's just you not know, allowed a person to be 20, 21, 
but she stopped, you know, doing the monthly menstruations from 2014. She went to the hospital, they found she had a problem with the hormones. There was an there was imbalance, something was missing, and she was told she would never be a proper woman because of that absence of that hormone. Mm. And you guess what? The, the baby started budging up. She started looking as if she's five months pregnant. She's just you know, a girl trying to, you know, to, to find what to do in life, and this is what is happening to her. She came into a seed planting. Just think, think about it. This is a seed planting service. Every year we plant seeds for the year. Mm -hmm. She came for the seed planting session. She was right at the back among a thousand of people. I don't mean flat. Whilst we are praying, I never laid hands on anyone. While I'm praying in flat, there she feels the hand. Light on her tummy. <coughs> you call tummy or belly? Light on her tummy. <laughs> but miracles, you. You know, <laughs> were so confused. <laughs> <laughs> he says, You. You what? You stop. <laughs> say you. Give way. Meaning, give way. No. Give way. Don't you. Don't you. And she, <laughs> she felt the hand on her tongue. In the sense. And right there, the tongue went back to normal. Amen. Amen. Barely one week. She started having her menstruations. Amen. Amen. She was testifying to us, and we were like, Did it happen in the service? I said, Yes. Mm -hmm. This is what happened. We miss many things because we are not sensitive mm -hmm. and spiritually knowledgeable mm -hmm. to know that today may be the right day. Amen. Let me tell you something. You know, Samson, all of you know about Samson. Yes. I'm, I'm just going to give you spiritual thoughts. Yes, sir. Because I'm not going to settle down on a message. I can't do that. But a couple of things so that we can pray together. Mm -hmm. uh, you know Samson? Samson lost his, his power, mm -hmm. the strength that God gave to him. When he lost it, they took off, got out his eyes. Mm -hmm. Tell me, how many times do you think? Samson prayed to God for the restoration. So many times. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I believe he repented several times. Mm -hmm. He prayed to God so many times. Mm -hmm. But there was a day he needed to descend. Mm -hmm. This time, he's drawn to, to an arena. He has been taken to an arena. Mm -hmm. Look, that he was sensitive enough of what is going to happen. He never doubted what God is going to do in that service. Amen. Amen. Or rather in that meeting. Amen. When he was brought into that place, he said, he asked the young man, would you tell me where I am? Do I have pillars? He said, yes. Can you take me to feel one pillar? He felt one. He says, can you also take me to feel the other one? Why is he doing that? He knows if I'm gonna pray today, mm. something is gonna happen. Amen. Amen. I have prayed several times, mm. but not today. I feel today is different. Amen. 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 So he felt the pillars first. Mm -hmm. After feeling the pillars, he said, Lord, allow me mm -hmm. to die with these people. Mm -hmm. Who told him that this time the prayer will be answered? Mm -hmm. Spiritual sensitivity. Yes, okay. yes. When we walk into the presence of God, become spiritually sensitive. Amen. Know what God has brought into mm -hmm. that sense. Mm -hmm. God comes in flavors. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, I'm telling you. God comes in flavors like vanilla, <laughs> strawberry. Mm -hmm. okay. And you have to descend yeah. the, the flavor of the day. Mm -hmm. Amen. So that you don't miss it. Yes. He may come on that day just to prosper me, mm -hmm. to bless me. Mm -hmm. The Bible says, and the, the power was present. To what? To him. Mm -hmm. So on that particular day, 
It was for the healing, mm -hmm. not deliverance. Mm -hmm. And if you were sick on that particular day, and you walked into that service, you were supposed to be healed. Mm -hmm. Amen. I don't know what you're already discerning today, mm -hmm. but I feel the anointing of God. Amen. I'm telling you, Amen. I was even asking myself, I said, this is the same feeling I had last week. Mm -hmm. But of course, today is much, much more. Mm -hmm. I just walked in and sat there. The presence of God just came so strong on me. Mm -hmm. I was saying, is it that the people here have actually brought God in this room? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Seriously, I was asking where I was, where was I was sitting here. Is it that God, they have brought him here? Mm -hmm. That all of us will come and find him? Mm -hmm. Or have I brought him here? Mm -hmm. I was asking myself. This said, we lose so many things because of spiritual ignorance. Mm -hmm. Because we are not sensitive enough. Mm -hmm. And I, I told you about carelessness and neg negligence. We don't want to go back to that. But let me show you something that I wanted to have. Time and talk to you. Give me Genesis 1 26. That is number one. This is number two. Slide as much as you can. Do whatever you can. It's going to help you. It's going to help you. I'm coming again. We're going to have now we know, enough time. The proper conference. Amen. 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 The proper conference. Give me Genesis 1 26. And you give first so that you give that finish like everything else. It says, and if God said, let us make man in our image, in our image, and he says, after our likeness, you see there is a, a command there, let them have dominion, telling you, dominion of man is in the realization of your image. And your likeness. Mm -hmm. You want to realize your dominion? Know your image and your likeness. Amen. You know your image and your likeness, you move into dominion. Amen. Amen. For your information, you are meant to be a man of dominion. Amen. This is a blessing mm -hmm. that God released. For humankind. Mm -hmm. Not for the special people. In every man, there is dominion. Yeah. There is an area where God meant you to be a king. Mm -hmm. And you will only rise in that area by you knowing your image and your likeness. Once you know your image and likeness in that area, you will never be a follower. Mm -hmm. You'll be in flat. Amen. All of you here, you have got all those areas. Mm -hmm. Are you getting this? Amen. But now, this is a problem. The biggest problem of people is the definition and, the, and, and, and understanding of those two words, image and likeness. I'll make it as simple as I can mm -hmm. so that you understand it. Image simply means the moral nature. God says, I want the man to be like us in the image. In other words, we are made in the moral nature of God. <clears throat> what do I mean by moral nature? God is good. He made man good. Mm -hmm. Take it for me. We can't do certain things unless the seed of evil is planted in us. Amen. In our in our natural make, makeup, in our natural design, we have limits of how we can do certain things. Because we are all made in the image of God. Mm -hmm. So that is the moral nature. Mm -hmm. Who are you? Mm -hmm. The qualities of your life. That's the image. Likeness is the capacity or abilities. Oh, now, mind you, in God, abilities flow from identity. Mm -hmm. If you don't identify yourself, you have limited your 
abilities. Amen. Your capacity is actually determined by your identity. Mm -hmm. We normally think sometimes let's pursue, pursue the capacity, let's pursue abilities. Mm -hmm. But that's not the way God works. Yeah. He first of all identify you because he knows your abilities will flow out Amen. from your identification. Amen. From your identity. Yeah. People think, okay, make man, give man money. He will be rich. That's the thinking of the world. Mm -hmm. God doesn't do that. God will never give you money first. God will identify you first. Amen. He will make sure he has actually put a blueprint on you. Mm. He has actually uh, changed your identity. Mm. Where now you can say, I'm rich even before you have got money. Amen. Amen. When you come to that place, that's when now ideas change. Mm -hmm. The thinking changes. Amen. Now you see the abilities to make money. Amen. Amen. Are you getting this? Yes, sir. This is the biggest problem we have had. Mm. Mostly with us from Africa. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's why we have been chasing and chasing and chasing. We have never got anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because we don't get before we become something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You don't do that. It doesn't work in that way. The anointing is always there. Amen. It works a man who has changed. Let's, let's spice it up a little bit with a couple of things because I want us to pray together about money. Okay, go to Daniel chapter 11, verse uh, 35. Let's look at these things. Daniel 11. Praise God. That's how God works. Not just how God works. That's the way man works. Amen. 
If I get, if your thinking is a one million, I'll put it like in the figures. If your thinking is a one million US dollars, one million US dollars, and in your hands, you have got 10,000 US dollars. Do you know what it happens? This law does not allow you to, 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 to remain at 10,000 because mm -hmm. you are a one million. Mm -hmm. Your mind will be forced to uh -huh. generate ideas. Mm -hmm. Your body is forced mm -hmm. to bring out abilities Amen. so that you can multiply 10,000 to one million. Amen. Amen. There will be a man that will have the word 10,000 today and will be stuck at 10,000. Amen. Mm -hmm. But there'll be somebody else that cannot stay to them. It, it works even in, in everywhere you work. Yeah. Mm. You come there with the blessing of one million in your mind. Mm -hmm. Do you know what happens? Mm -hmm. You force the system mm -hmm. because you can't be confined. I mean, this is a lot. Mm -hmm. They cannot give you less than what you are. Mm -hmm. So when you come at the place, you force. You demand it from the system mm -hmm. that they should give you according to who you are. Amen. Mm -hmm. That's when you find that the policy changes mm. or you are promoted. Amen. Amen. People don't understand what has happened to him. Amen. You change the policy or oh, there is a promotion mm. because there is a man there. Amen. There is a man there that is a one million US dollar thinking. Mm. He can't die at the 10,000. Mm -mm. Are you getting what I'm saying? Amen. The vice versa is true. Mm -hmm. When you give a man who is a 10,000, you give him one million. <laughs> Nature, the body, recognizes an error. Mm. <laughs> that this is not a one million person. Mm. That's when it develops. Sir. Now you develop careless. Okay, guys, we just finished the service and it was so, so powerful. My life will never be the same again. Thank you for tuning in today. I pray that God keeps on protecting you and blessing you. Join us same time next week by the grace of God. Remain blessed and highly favored. Amen.